Hello, my name is Banu Ramaswamy and I'm a physiotherapist who clinically deals with conditions of older adults as well as Parkinson's. It's Parkinson's I'm going to speak about today. This condition, a neurological condition, is the second most common after stroke in the older adult population. Until a cure is found, there are things people can do to minimise the progress as well as to keep their independence and physiotherapy plays one part of this. When you consider the things that alter over time with Parkinson's, the main thing is posture. And while someone might not think that that's that important, if you think about it, when you have an upright posture, you can keep your balance, you can eat easily and swallow, you can breathe normally, and also you have enough air to project your voice. So just something as simple as starting to bend forward will actually affect different aspects of your lifestyle. It's important to learn how to maintain your posture. Balance is also an issue that starts to go and this in turn will affect how you actually move about, whether it's to get up off a chair or your bed or just walk around and carry things. Again, the worse your balance gets and your mobility in general, the harder it is to carry on a near normal life. And therefore, if you can find things to actually maintain that for as long as possible, you're halfway on the way to maintaining yourself. The other thing that physiotherapy can offer is education. And this is about the condition and how you might progress and things that you can do to actually help your family, other carers and even healthcare professionals understand. Often, as we said, there is a link with a lot of older people actually being diagnosed with the condition. And in itself, age can lead to a more sedentary life. This will affect how your muscles perform, how your joints work. And therefore, one of the things that it's important to know is how to actually maintain the effects of becoming less and less mobile as you age. Falling seems to be quite common. And whilst there is fear related to the issue of possibly falling, there's a lot you can do to actually strengthen your muscles, make sure that you can actually accommodate to balance losses and also teach yourself how to get on and off the floor. The last thing that physiotherapy will offer are strategies to actually help you move. For some people with Parkinson's, there comes a point where they find that they actually have difficulty starting movement. They may have difficulty whilst they're moving and they come across an object such as a door frame. And because of that, it makes them freeze and people describe this as being glued to the floor and they find it difficult again to stop movement and start movement. There are different strategies that you can be taught that will help you overcome some of these. In time you may have to learn a different way to different strategy or a different cue but it's certainly worthwhile learning things at the beginning so that you can then prepare for how the condition might progress. Come and see a physiotherapist and see what we can do to help you.